Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I want to wish you guys all a very, very blessed Hallow's Eve. I hope you guys enjoy these seasons, right? We This is the, the kickoff season. <laughs> um, I hope you guys are as excited as I am. Anyways, let's get into your reading, Cancer. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of October 2021. Spirit guides, ancestors, archangels, please step forward. Allow us to see clearly and concisely what is unfolding for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for this month of October 2021. All right, here we go. Your first card, Cancer, we have the Five of Cups. Maybe feeling a bit emotional, a bit overwhelmed. This can also represent going through the motions, trying to deal with emotions more than anything. Um, I'm hearing for some of you guys, this could be you feeling a little bit off, uh, feeling like you're a little bit more sensitive than usual. Your next card here is the Ten of Cups. So with the Ten of Cups, I feel for some of you guys, there could be some type of falling out. Or some type of um, some type of dealing with family, uh, the family dynamic. Uh, this could be dealing with a sister, a brother, a mother, a father type of energy. Um, I'm almost hearing like feeling a bit rejected. So for some of you guys, you may be in your feelings in the month of October, and it could possibly have something to do with a family member not being able to communicate uh, the right way. I feel that emotions get the best on both sides and there may be some feelings hurt here. Your next card is the Eight of Wands. So the Eight of Wands is quick communication coming through. Um, for some of you guys, you may be dealing from, uh, when we're talking about relationships, you may be dealing with a relationship that is at a distance. Or for some of you guys, there could have been some type of falling out, some type of uh, break or separation here. With the Ten of Cups um, and the Eight of Wands, there is going to be, uh, there is going to be communication that opens up for you guys for this month of October. So if you've been hoping or wanting to hear from someone um, that perhaps is at a distance or uh, you guys are not on talking terms, that's definitely going to be unfolding for you. Now, your next card here is the Four of Swords. So what they're telling you is for the month of uh, October, it's going to be very important not to... Um, allow your emotions to take over when making decisions, Cancer. I feel that you're going to be a little bit more sensitive than usual. And this could also represent um, making you feel very vulnerable. And when we feel vulnerable, sometimes uh, we counterattack, right? We uh, take things very personal. And um, in that process of taking things personal, we become more aggressive because there's almost a feeling of wanting to protect ourselves or protect our feelings or our energy. So I feel you guys um, having the need to be very grounded. I would highly encourage you guys to go towards um, anything that has to do with your element of water. So it'd be by a creek, by a lake, by a beach, by uh, the ocean. If you can, you can always just run a warm bath using the element of water and asking the element of water to assist you to purify you and to cleanse you so that you can be grounded i do see the four of swords here so there is a need for some type of meditation some type of stillness some type of um like i said grounding so i feel that for a lot of you guys you're going to be challenged uh, when we're talking about connections more specifically when we're talking about uh, the family dynamic or dealing with someone from the family that you feel either attacks you, uh, whether it's verbally or I don't see anything physical, but I do see verbally uh, feeling attacked, feeling like uh, they are discrediting you or they're offending you. Um, however, that's quickly going to clear up. Um, and I feel that the moment that they, you know, uh, you guys both on both sides, uh, there is a clearing of that. There's a feeling of like, your energy being very depleted. So again, if you feel in the month of October that you're being challenged or um, that people are really testing you, I would highly encourage you guys to ground yourselves and to try to steer away from any type of drama only because the Four of Swords indicates having the need to be still and not reacting. Okay, my lovelies, I wish you guys the very best. I hope you guys enjoyed this reading and we'll see each other soon. Till then, blessings to all. Bye.